Thank you so much for joining me as Game Edge. We're back in Miss Survival. We left off last episode. That's right. We still have some cooking to do and getting some stuff done while uh, Scott just stands there and does nothing. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So she made us some new arrows. It's fantastic. I've been looking forward to getting that completed. I thank you very much to uh, find Kate for that. Can you move? You're such a tool. You're such a tool, dude. All right. Um, we're going to drop that off. We still have some chicken on us. We can eat it. We did have a good night's sleep, but they did pass by. I was able to re-sleep at uh, the Zombros at night, and we were able to re-sleep, and it was phenomenal. It was phenomenal. We're also going to need to start up a fire uh, over here and get our water into this. I think we only need two of them anyway, so let's drop this. We'll give all of this fine stuff. All ten. Thank you very much. I'm not positive if I give ten, it'll show up. I think it's sixteen total anyways on this thing here. Let's do sixteen. Is sixteen or fourteen? Sixteen. Yeah, sixteen. I don't think you can put any more. Let's just try for shits and giggles. Did we lose it? No, we don't lose it. Phenomenal. All right, we're going to need some uh, wood, and we're also going to need some of that stuff. So we got that here. Uh, I got some extra wood in here. There we go. How much do we need? Four or two? Is it four? Yeah, it's four. Okay, it's all good. We'll go over here. We'll split this in half, and we'll take the four and move this back together. Phenomenal. Done. Okay, we have meat there. We're going to need to get some more meat done on that side. There's a lot to get completed here. Uh, Scott's going to need to chop down some more of this. Get some more wood done. But keep him busy as much as possible because we don't want him to uh, continue with any kind of problems. Um, yeah, actually, cancel task and see if you can continue this. Uh, let's get uh, 30 of those. Scott, the tool man. See if you get yourself out of here and do that work, dude. Be appreciative very, very much. All right, we got a couple of logs. We got that. Oh, Jesus. You want, you want the other door now? Yeah, I thought so. What an asshole. <laughs> you got to appreciate him. It's cut. All right, um, there we go. This is good. This is good. That's good. Let's get this done. Let's light this baby. And we've got everything in here. That's perfect. It's just still done all right so that's all in there it's all distilling as it's going to go through here finally we got at least that going and we're going to need to get ourselves the other ones done we'll close up our doors just in case something happens during time we're here we don't want any kind of problems we have all that meat that we need to get done we can throw our buckets um in the back of the truck before i forget here the ones that are empty i think i have like a couple already in here we could use these for traps that's great uh this can go with the rocks and this one's somewhat foolish uh we can still utilize it a little more good all right so next time we go out we'll fill up those buckets it's gonna be quite helpful we'll just throw this bucket down here on the ground it stays always nice and full great don't need to store those babies up again close that door and get ourselves rolling now all right to grab our meat over here put these for the traps afterwards more meat yeah, it's gonna take some serious amount of crafting here <laughs> for us to get all this done it's not a tremendous amount of meat either this is not the worst we've ever had uh but definitely a lot a lot of meat okay um but for now temporarily make some space we'll throw that in there and uh, where did i grab these from again i think it was from here wasn't it yep nice and we'll throw a rock in there all right so while we're waiting for this to get completed let's do this let's craft these babies up you need some salt a knife and of course some of this so yeah let's get uh 16 of those done Perfect. Let him figure it out for himself. Just let him figure it out for himself. He needs it. All right. Then, then again, shift click would be so freaking nice for now. Uh, then I have to go through this, but it's okay. It makes it feel realistic. We're going to place them on the actual line. And I'm not sure if we're going to need another one. I think we'll have enough. Definitely get more from the bear, I believe. I really do. I think it takes up three of my racks when I finish up with the bears with the guts and everything else that I have. But this is okay. It's better than nothing. This is deer meat, by the way. If you guys are wondering, we did get deer meat. Oh, man, Scott's freaking me out. He's staying behind me all the time. Okay, and now uh, we're going to craft up the rest of these little suckers. Yep, get them all done. Scott's like flying away. Kate's out there. We're going to finish up their gate. We're going to move our stuff most likely to that area for them to build. But uh, Actually, I'm going to move my bed and make a bed over there. I think I'm going to keep this like this for them to work in. Uh, this will be their base, and my base is going to be on the other side, which is going to be that big building over there. 
Then again, I guess we're going to need three of them. Maybe it's best we keep them like that. I don't know. It's always a that question mark. They're going to need to work anyways. We'll figure it out. Oops, no, wrong way, Game Edge. Wrong way. There. Good stuff. All right, it's going to take a little bit for it to dry, but at least we're going to get some meat out of this. For now, we have the chickens, and I would like to get a couple more of those arrows made via the fine Kate's craftsmanship. And we also need to finish up in our gun and get that completed uh, today, too. So, yeah, we worked so hard to go and get all those components and stuff. Uh, there's still a little bit of stuff left in here. There's a couple of you in there. Some food. We can drop that off into our food container and this and that. There we go. Uh, is this empty? That's empty. I emptied that out afterwards. Beautiful. And, of course, a little bit of food in there in case of emergency. Okay. I feel better now. We got that done. Scott 2.0 is protecting our little shed. I love him. He's doing a great job, and we appreciate him very much. <laughs> He's doing a great job, man. He's not moving unlike the rest of these little suckers. Yeah, I'm talking about you, Scott. I really am. Now, I'm thinking about destroying these uh, ones up here. This one here and this one. Uh, so we can have a double gate opening up on this side instead. And I'm thinking we might have to destroy this one. Now, I'm not positive which way it's going to open and close. It's the only thing I never figured out exactly how to make that work and figure it out. But we can do that afterwards. Uh, they're not going to use sticks. It's not a big deal anyways. It's not a big deal. I mean, it's nice to have them open and close properly, but... Grab a couple of you. We need a bunch of you for the gun. And for the fencing, so we'll grab that. Okay, and for the gun, we're gonna need what again for that? Which we're gonna ask Kate to do. And this one, they seem to really like the other place. I'm telling you right now, they've been hovering over that place over there like it's it's like the end of the world for them. They want that place so badly. All right, we might have to open this up for stupid Scott. I saw him walking around. <laughs> Such a tool. Such a tool. All right, so that's good. We got this, this, and I want to get the gun repaired. There we go. AI and Kate. I'd like you to fix up my sniper, please, if possible, my hunting rifle, so we can get that completed. Where is Kate right now? Anybody see Kate? I saw her next to the fence last time. Did she finished that already? Damn, girl. You're... You'll be a woman soon, and soon we'll be able to zoom in and kill some. Oh, that's the worst singing ever. I know. It's all good. <laughs> oh, I also have to figure out how to make this again here. Copper? I think it's zinc, right? We need for that. So we can get some of that stuff done. All right. I thought I saw the next one there. Okay. Uh, there we go. Some zinc. I think it's zinc we need for that. I'm not positive. I forget the exact amount. So, yes, we have our sniper rifle. And it's great to right click on it and zoom in very, very nicely. And this is going to be here. We'll grab all this fine loot. You can stack them after you pull them in here. Boom. Okay. So, yeah, that gives me brass. And this is giving me what? I don't think I need all of that, do I? It's gonna be none. I forget if it was like what the recipe was. It's because you don't make it every single time, right? So this is where it becomes a big hassle. Six and eight. Yeah. So yeah, definitely for one of these. So this is gonna give us a brass we're gonna need. That's a lot, isn't it? Damn it. Hope I'm not overdoing it. Okay, and melt that together. Not a lot, but it'll be something. And uh, better than nothing. It's going to take some time right now for us to get done. 44 minutes in-game. Ouch. Oh, man, I love highness. Now, maybe fill this maybe up. I don't think we have any ammo on us for this. Right here. 7.62 is going to go in our inventory. Swap this out. Our knife is going to be a new knife soon. Okay, this is good. Reload. Very cool. Thank you, Kate. Appreciate that very much. You are a hard worker. I can guarantee you that. All right. We have our chicken here we need to take care of, too. And need to get ourselves our fire going right after that. So we're going to slice and dice a whole bunch of chickens up. 
And we need to finish up the fencing on that side. So there's a lot to do, but we're going to have to hold off a tiny bit here before we finish that fencing on that side. And we can put away the salt because we're not going to use that for now. We do have a toilet, quite a bit of salt here. Is this cured already? It is dry. All right, good. So we have a second one coming in. We'll be able to make ourselves another bow. Uh, while we're waiting here, uh, how many knives do I have? I don't think I have a ton of knife. Right? Do I have? I have one more knife and one machete. Now the cost of making, repairing one of these is duct tape components three three six three three two duct tape. To make a shovel we're going to have to make. Yeah, it's definitely better off doing it through here, isn't it? 10 and 15. Hmm, 10 and 15. No, actually, it's pretty valuable to do this. So we'll wait up a bit. We'll see if it gets worse as we do this, but that's okay. All right, let's just uh, slice and dice this little suckers up. And then we'll be able to get Oscar and make some more arrows. We'll see if we have enough room to do this. I might have to... Yeah, that's what I thought. Damn, chicken has more legs than expected. All right, drop this. Drop that. We'll take some tomato paste for food. Drink that. Perfect. And a sewing kit. I think that goes on the... Here. Yep. Or pills and other things we don't want. Okay. Drop you. What we can do is render the fat on the second one. Once we get the second one carved up, we can render the fat on the sucker. So let's do this again. We'll harvest the babies up. Got the feathers there. Zip our knife a little bit. Very nice. Slice and dice that little chicken. Beauty. Wow, that's a lot of fatty. A lot of fats right there. Okay, so it's going to need eight wood in there. And ignite. Perfect. Leave some fat going, dripping that baby down. Like I was mentioning, I might make a second fire here just to get the fat dripping for next time. Uh, this is still going on. It's going to take some time for it to drip all the way into the water. We can remove the water while it's doing this. So it's not a big problem. You can take it here and fill yourself up uh, very nicely. You don't have to worry about it. So if you're thirsty as heck, no worries. It's all good. Okay. I think this is all cooking here. Good. Boom. I really need those feathers beyond anything else, but I don't want to waste the meat. Which is the tough part. We got tons of it now. I wish we had a fridge. And we should probably look at it. We need a generator to get that going, which will probably be the next episodes or so. We do need to rescue Rachel too. And that is definitely on my plans. But I mean we're not gonna be able to eat this stuff over there. I wish we could dry it up like we're doing this and put it on those, but unfortunately we cannot do it. Now as long as the traps are full and they have some stuff in that we can utilize it. And keep the I think the uh, prey well the uh, the catches in there. I don't think they go away. I don't believe they do. So we can leave them in there. I don't think they rot away. What I'm trying to say. This one was already full, and that one's already full. Excellent. All right, so we got a couple of traps. We can catch maybe some mice again, some mice and men, and <laughs> build to eat like a king for the next couple of days. That's for sure. Okay, uh, how long left on those chickens? Not a ton of time left. Really? Not a ton. Okay. Well. We'll throw what we can in here and uh, deal with it. This pile will be right to the good pile and the other pile will be the older pile. You'd be surprised how much you can eat in one serving, so we're good. We're going to need to make ourselves a couple more of these. We have a ton of that. Sticks we have a whole lot of. So for now, Kate, which I want you to work on this. Get three of those. And I'm going to have to make myself some arrows on the other side. Is this done yet? No. I don't think I'll be able to ask them because they somehow don't like to uh, make arrowheads. You see, if I ask Scott to do it for some reason, he just doesn't want to make it there. He'll come right here, but he won't go there. I don't get it. 
You guys know why. You can tell me. I have no idea. Grab this. Beauty. And that is still dripping, so we still have a little bit of fat left. Okay, let's uh, let's make this happen. I'm gonna go and make these actually before this happens. Before the three, two minutes, yeah. I think the mist is in. Holy crap. This is gonna take how many hours? Holy moly. Well, it's gonna take some serious amount of time. I think the fire will be up by the time we finish this. Pretty sure that fat rendered. How much time left on fire? I really spent a lot of time doing that. Uh, 18 minutes. All right. Okay. Uh, I think he made more logs for us. He did. Good job, buddy. Good job. How much time left in this? Yeah, two hours. I think I put too much in it. Anyways, it's all good. Uh, harvest this baby up. We can finish up all our fine work tonight. We'll put on lights on the truck too, because it's gonna get late soon. And we're gonna have some problems or else. Okay, while well, it's taking the time doing that, let's put the fat in here. It smells good, doesn't it, Kate? You want some chicken? I got some chicken for you. Can I store this in here? I can. So I do think I can store that stuff in here too. Nice. Okay, um bum, 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 bum. we have 56 minutes left. That's so why I'm gonna need to take a a little bit back here. Oops, split half. There we go. More enough. We'll grab this stuff here. Yeah, we do need to eat anyway, so let's grab this. Hopefully it won't go bad by the time I finish eating. Just in time. Sweet. Alright, let's harvest up the last little bit of that chicken. That way it's all done for. Then we'll ask Kate to finalize what she needs to finish on that side. Put those in here. More fat. Grab the full container. Bring it back inside. We can also fill up our fine little lamps which we've been using there we go pressing Q if you guys are wondering I don't think I've used this one too much no I haven't okay that's good um, how much time left here where is it again this is one this is 1.5 1.5 1.5 and I've probably used a lot of this one sweet and we're gonna ask Kate to do some more of these why is she not doing any of them. Hope I didn't cancel that. It disappeared everything, did it? I know it didn't. I got all my stuff back. Good. Okay, Kate. Let's do this. Let's have all the doors open for the fine lady to get her butt in there. Drop you. Okay, well that's our max we can do anyway, so we're good. I won't need to finish up all of these right now. Cancel task, gave us back what we needed. Beautiful. All right, we got our brass too. A little brass ingots. Uh, I think it's made here too, isn't it? Damn it. And I need 7.62. Oh, we should need a reload bench for that to figure it out. Okay, we'll put this here for now. I forgot about that. Which I think we're going to need some brass for that. Uh, we have brass, sorry. We're probably going to need some copper for that. I have a tiny bit left. I don't think I have enough to do that. What do we need to craft that baby up with? I forgot about the reload bench. Oh, crap. It needs two copper. Yeah, I won't have enough. We're going to have to go back to the mines before I can make that. That damn you. <laughs> There's always something. Always, always, always. Yeah, we did anyways. Because we're like that. Beauty. And how long left of fat here? I still got quite a bit left to do. 
Got another hour. We'll split this in half. Let's throw it in. Get the full two hours in there. Oh, almost two hours. There we go. Whatever. A little bit of a waste, but that's okay. Uh, but get our truck and turn on the lights. Get a little bit of lighting here. We'll throw in all the food we don't want right now. It has tons of food. I know we need a fridge. We do have it. We have the capability of making it. We need a generator. I believe we're going to go to the other mine, too. There's two mines. We're probably going to go to the other one because we've done this one quite a bit. I think we're going to go back to the other one and check it out. It's been a while, so we haven't gone and visited. And maybe it would be nice. All right. Did she do the arrows? No, she didn't do the freaking arrows. What the hell's her problem? What's her problem? Does she not want to live here? What's the problem here, Kate? Do we have an issue? Are you becoming scottified, I should say. Scottification. Yeah, get working. What's the problem with you? It's only six arrows. Okay, yeah, continue working, Kate. Don't darn it, you. We could look bad. All right. <laughs> I should just make it myself, you know. Solve all the freaking problem, dude. I know. I know. Okay, so we got tons of sticks and stuff. We have a couple of arrows here. We got a couple left over there. That is great. I also saw some charcoal here in the bomb, which we can drop off. We'll use those for crafting for uh, gunpowder afterwards. We're not going to eat it right now. And we got a smoke in there. Just because. So accept it. <laughs> it's going to have to be there. All right, we got some more zinc in here to drop off. So, you know, zinc is actually quite important-ish, but uh, at this point, we really don't need it uh, as much because we have more than enough of stuff. We need more of copper. Surprisingly enough, one of the few things I didn't think I'd need, really. I didn't think I'd need that much of it. Okay, that fire is going. That's going. It's looking real nice. Okay, um, let's drink some water. You know what? First, before we drink... Grab that stack of food, because that's the old one. The first one we did yesterday. And we'll just fill our bellies up a tiny bit. We can splurge. Since we worked so hard, we deserve it all. So I need the reload bench. That's going to take some copper, which means I need to go to the mines, but I do need to res rescue Kate first. Only thing I don't like about that is that I have a limited amount of hunting rifle uh, ammo. We have 13 total, which is not great. We do have a lot of pistol and, of course, rifle. Uh, we do have a new bow over there. And I believe it's in here. Oops, there we go. A tactical. Nice. Do I have one of these ready? Wait a second. Uh, add arrows. There's eight in this one. Eight in this one. Beauty. I didn't realize I had both of them already. Okay, so this is going to have to come with us because it'll be a fast swap out in case we need to. And we'll have to bring a couple more arrows too because we're going to try and kill them all off. But the thing is, we don't know how many people are going to be fighting on that side. And it's going to be something that's going to be quite hard for us to fight. So we'll see how that goes. We'll see. Um, okay, oops. Open up. Done. All right, so let's get ourselves an early night's sleep. Got our car lights on. We'll let the fire kind of finish up its work. All right, so it seemed that uh, somebody woke up with these guys. And uh, I don't know. I don't have matches on me. I don't have matches on me. Damn it. Kate, what are you doing? Stop teasing them. Stop teasing the locals. Okay, we'll turn off our light because this is going to get blinding. Okay. Hey, how you doing, buddy? Doing pretty good, yeah. Have a good day. Okay. That, that worked out really good. And I'll throw that trash. That's only one that woke us up. Jeez, it sounded like a whole bunch of them. There's still more food down there. The fire did finish. I don't know if he's stuck in the other building. We still need to finish up those darn gates over there, which we have to do tomorrow morning before we head back out. I'm right over here at Tasty. Look, Tasty Fresh Human. It's a pile of meat right there, dudes. Oh, crap, he's on me. I thought his friend was coming at me. I was saying, can he not get it over here?
Oh crap. Oh god, thank god you're dumb. Bunk! Whack a mole. Oh, thank God these guys are not bright. Thank God their brains are already mushed up. You know, I always seem like I'm, I'm going for this one and close, so let's do that. I don't understand. They can't get in here. Oh. Oh, they're trying to get Scott. Can you wake up, dude? They're causing a whole frenzy. I haven't figured out that he can walk right past here. That's okay. That's okay. Thanks a lot, Scott, for causing a frenzy, by the way. Appreciate it. You want to go back inside? Want to go inside? Want to take you for a walk? Oh, frig that. Oh, my God, they're inside the building. Holy crap, that's the first time they've ever gone inside the building. Right in, didn't he? he? Sure did. Got a lot of potatoes and a lot of salt coming in here. I uh, will throw this out actually. Okay. Let's see if we can get some sleep now. Uh, I'll throw you off in there and I'll put the potatoes and stuff in there. Ah, oh, crap. This is all Scott's fault, by the way. You know why I blame Scott? It makes the life a lot easier. It does. It makes my life a whole lot easier. I blame Scott for everything. In every game I play, I blame Scott. I don't know why. I don't think there's anybody Scott that I know of that would want to blame, but you know what? I'm blaming this Scott. Do you see your friend? Look. Man, Scott is just causing a whole bunch of problems, dudes and deaths. It's going to be a long night. Let's see if we can get some more sleep here. We're going to turn these off and uh, deal with what we have to deal with. Let's see if we wake up. Uh, why don't you come to bed with me, Kate, if you want to? I don't mind sharing. Bed's open for you. No? Okay. Right. Let's get some more sleep. Uh, let's try for four hours. No? Damn you all. Scott's got like 20 of them on him, I think. Holy moly, Scott. You're such a tool, dude. Okay. Salt. Screw this shit. As soon as they figure out they can go around there, it won't be so funny. One guy looked like he died. He hit Scott there with a stick, too. On Kate. Look at him, he's all bent out of shape due to that. He's completely racked in that door. <laughs> Mr. Potato. The other guy's still on the other side. Damn, it's not going to stop, is it? Not the gunpowder, though. That's a fake grunter right now. Okay, how's my uh, sledgehammer doing? 77, still in good shape. These guys are getting bent out of shape, dudes. That's sick amounts, too. You want to get in here? 
You know, you're such an ass. You're such an ass. I'm grabbing your ass because you won't let me push you in. You got like five seconds, dude. Five, four, three, two, screw you. Come and get him. No. No one even wants you, Scott. Okay. Let's sleep for three hours. Okay. I think we're up and it's nice and early. It's totally grunting, but most likely from the dead one that's over there. And it looks like we survived the night, ladies and gents. We did survive the night. A little bit craziness, but we had a lot of fun getting it done. At least we got at least this completed and that completed, plus our food. Extremely important for us to go out and get Rachel. And I'm going to debate whether to go see Rachel next or whether we should go and do uh, some more looting down the street on the other side. But I think we're doing good loot. Uh, we do need to finish up building a tiny bit, but I mean, it's not desperate. We need to get Rachel back ASAP. And we have enough stuff for us to do this right now. I, I think we're, we're pretty well off. So we'll be able to hit up maybe that big camp for next episode. So thank you for being here. Do appreciate it. Again, if you guys are enjoying us, please take time. Hit the like button. If you're brand new, go ahead and subscribe. Jump in. Join up. Come and see what we're all about. Great community of people. And, of course, if you enjoy, uh, of course, uh, gaming and stuff, uh, you'll be able to talk to them. Come and join me on Discord or Twitter. The links are always in the description field. Thank you so much for being here and being so important to this channel. Uh, you guys make this happen every day. So thank you, thank you, thank you. This game image, I'll catch you guys on the flip side. Mm -hmm.